YouTubers. Wanted to talk today a little bit about a uh, Comet coaster brake hub. I don't see a lot out on the net about them, uh, especially here on YouTube, so I wanted to show you a little bit of a demonstration what they work like um, and also give you some alternatives to the new departures and Bendix hubs out there. I'm a big fan of new departure um, but I have a 1965 uh, Roadmaster Jet Pilot bicycle that I'm kind of cleaning up and rebuilding and it had this Comet Super uh, hub on it and so I checked it out. It coasts really nice. Um, I'm a big fan of a bike that coasts easy. Um, so uh, I, I put some time into it, cleaned it up, greased it up, and threaded it into the original rims. Um, used some spokes I had laying around here and um, got it up and rolling. And I'm going to show you some things about the Comet Hub. So first of all, here is the rebuilt hub. Um, as mentioned, you can see how easily it coasts. Um, the brake action works very well. And it's got some nice chrome on it too. Um, also with these hubs, They've got the oil port on them. You can see, I'll get a little bit of a closer shot here, hopefully. Um, the oil port, you just pop it over to the side and you can put some oil in it. There it is. It's got the little cover on it. Okay. And I also wanted to show you, I have an extra hub laying here, and I wanted to show you the inside of it and talk about a little bit about adjusting the end play. So here's the hub, and here's the brake action. Okay, I'll try to get this so you can see that as you brake, it pushes apart the shoes which go against your hub. So again, it's a nice coaster brake. Um, this one, I took this one out of this hub because you can see some galding here on, on the original. Um, and I had an extra one laying around from a 24 inch bike that was like brand new. So I took the guts out of it and put it into this hub that I had for the 26 inch. This is a 36 hole hub and the 24 inch was a 28 hole hub. So I was able to just replace the axle and everything from the 24 inch hub and put it into my 26 inch hub. Um, this end play that I mentioned um, the best way to adjust the end play on these, since there's no um, jam nut on here, is I just bottomed this out on the threads on the axle on this side, like that. And then from this side, you have a jam nut. I loosen this up, and you can turn this around, which, which turns the threads in this and will adjust your end play in and then you can lock it from the side over here. Um, again, seems like a good hub so far. I'm real pleased with the way it coasts. I've seen lots of these around. I've avoided them in the past because most of the bikes that I use are the older, you know, pre- and post-war 1940s bikes. So um, with using, rebuilding this 1965 bicycle, ran into this Comet Super Hub, and so far, seems like a great hub. Thanks for watching.